All right, all right. How's, how's everybody doing tonight? Great? Fantastic. Uh, so I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm ready for the, I'm glad the holidays are over. Hopefully you guys are glad the, glad the holidays are over. They fucking suck, you know. Uh, they really suck for me because I, I not only got Christmas to worry about, but I, I also have my wife's birthday is Christmas Eve. Okay, yeah, so it really fucking sucks for me. And uh, I try to make it as special as possible. And this year, I, you know, I really made it special, actually. Uh, you know, we went out to dinner, did our normal little thing and all that. And then, and then I, 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 gave her, I gave her a, good, a great present, actually. It's the same thing I gave her last year, which was uh, come in the face. Uh, did I say that? Did I really fucking say that? Okay. No, it's, uh, no, we've been married a long time. We've been married uh, oh, about 11 years. 11 years of blisters. No. It's been good times. Uh, now, we, uh, we actually, I, uh, I took her out and got her all drunk the other night, which, gentlemen, you're with me on this. You probably, uh, you always want to get your lady drunk, but you only want to get her so drunk, you know, drunk enough where she's going to be a little bit of a slut, but not too drunk to where she's bringing up shit 15 years ago, you know, which happens quite fucking often for me for some reason. Uh, but, uh, but yeah, so, uh, so anyways, I'm, uh, I am, uh, since we've been married for so long, I've, uh, you know, we got to keep the, keep things hot in the bedroom, you know, yeah, so uh, lately I have kicked up the foreplay a little bit. I now have her up to four captains and cokes and two hits of GHB. I find she's a much more willing participant on what I'm trying to do. So, but, uh, but anyway, so, uh, so we have some kids. Uh, we've got a couple of kids. Uh, I am a stay at home dad. Yeah, that's pretty. Hey, it is nothing like the fucking pornos. I, that's what I thought in the beginning. It is nothing like that at all. No, not at all. <laughs> that's what I keep thinking, though, when I go to the park and then mommy and me's are sitting there and they're like, you get the fuck away from us. <laughs> You're just using that baby. I know you. So, but, uh, but no, my, uh, my, I have an eight-year-old daughter and, uh, and then we have an 18-month-old baby boy and... And uh, my daughter, the other day, she asked me helping her with her homework, which she's a second grader, which I can handle that. Third grader, I'm a little worried uh, what's going to happen there. But uh, I'm helping her out with her second grade homework. I'm, having her wor I'm working on the spelling words. And what they have to do with their spelling words, they take the word, and then they got to make it into a sentence, okay? And I'm thinking, this is great. She's doing her job. She's doing and getting the work done. But then I see the words and the sentences, okay? The first one, the word was bar, B-A-R. I'm like, okay. And I read the sentence. It says, last night, mom and dad went to the bar. I'm like, fucking great. Your teacher's going to be thinking good things about us. That's for fucking sure. But the next sentence is the one that kind of threw me for a loop a little bit. Uh, and the, the word was but, B-U-T. And the sentence was, last night I heard mom tell dad not in the butt. I'm like, really? Really, you little fucking bitch? I fucking teach you fucking some lessons. That's really fucking wrong. I know. I know it's wrong. So, uh... So with the new year and everything, you know, everybody working out. I worked out today. Uh, I did three sit-ups totally by fucking accident. <laughs> totally fucking accident. I was reaching for the remote three times. And I still feel the burn, actually. And my fucking really hurts. No, but uh, I actually, uh, I've been working, uh, lately I've been working on this uh, quitting smoking joke. And uh, I just gave it up. I'll give you a minute on that one. Do I need to repeat it? No, I didn't think so. That's, that's a good fucking joke. One of the best. One of the best fucking jokes all night. Okay, I, that's all right. I am the first comic all night. <laughs> so that works. But uh, no. I, uh, yeah, so anyways, I, I, uh, where was I here? Oh. So yesterday I was uh, putting some gas in my truck. And I saw a little sign on the gas pump, and it said, 24-hour uh, surveillance. It says, gas theft is a Class B misdemeanor. And I'm thinking, at these gas prices, that almost sounds worth it. It's a fucking misdemeanor. You know what else Class B misdemeanor? Graffiti. I'll do the fucking stealing gas all day long. All day long, so. Uh, anyways, uh, let's see here. Uh, so we... Uh, so uh, I'm going to bring it down a little bit, this uh, kind of a little morbid thing, but i got to get it off my chest. I've been thinking about it a lot. Uh, uh, a few weeks back, you might have known there was a guy that got hit and killed by a car on Interstate 15. He was running across the interstate. I don't know if you saw that or not. 
but it's on the news. I was actually on my way to a comedy uh, show, and uh, and I got locked into all this traffic, and I, I called my wife to find out what's going on and everything, and and uh, she told me, yeah, a guy got hit and stuff, and I'm like, oh, great. So then I finally get up to where the accident, where the scene was and everything, and I look on there, and I see right in the freeway is a fucking tennis shoe. And I'm looking at it, and I'm like, I got that same pair. <laughs> oh, that is so wrong, isn't it? But, yeah, that's... that's, that's uh, the chan- what are the chances of that? Yeah, I got rid of that pair. Uh, so uh, we got any uh, we got any pot smokers out there? I figured we had a one or two, or six or seven. But uh, yeah, I do like to uh, I like to smoke a little weed from time to time. Uh, marijuana is just like an American Express card. You never want to leave home without it. It's not accepted everywhere you go. So yeah, that's a good fucking joke. I know. Yeah, I had a little problem with marijuana, though. I, I, I actually, I, I OD'd. Yes, I did. It was like a six-hour nap. And I was really fucking hungry when I woke up. Really fucking hungry. But, uh, but anyways. But the thing about marijuana, I think, is, is funny, is that it's the only drug that if you have a bad trip, you're bragging about it. And usually asking, where can I get more of that fucking shit? Because I was really fucked up. I couldn't talk to anybody. <laughs> It was good. My face melted right off. It was fucking awesome. I love that stuff. My eyeballs felt right on the floor. So, uh, so we got any pet owners out there? I got some pet owners. All right. I uh, I have a couple pets at home, which I'm not happy about. Uh, I've got a I got an old dog and an old cat. And uh, every day I come home, I keep wishing that one of them is dead at least. Yeah, I, I'm really sick of having pets. I'm always hoping it's the cat because cats live for fucking ever. They do. They never fucking die. And I was thinking, actually, I would like to uh, come up with a new breed of cat because we all love kittens, right? Kittens are the best. They're great. But we don't like it when they grow up. So I'm thinking instead of short hair cats, I want to start breeding short-term cats where, where they just live to be an adult and then they die that fucking day. I think it really helped the cat population and it make everybody a lot happier about everything. Okay, that's really fucked up. No, no but uh, no, the animals are pretty old though. The, uh, my dog, my dog he's, uh, he's 11 years old, which uh, I believe, what is it? It's like seven years for every people year. So he's like 77 years old. And then the cat, the cat's like 12 years old, which in cat years, that's really old pussy. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. That's a fucking great joke. I like that one. That's one of my favorites. It is. It is one of my favorites. Now, I'm going to finish it up with my absolute favorite joke. And uh, you ready for this? This is a great one. Now, has anybody got satellite radio? A satellite radio? It's pretty awesome. I, I actually just had my satellite radio upgraded uh, to the all-access channel. So now I get, like, Howard Stern and all that. And I don't know if you know this or not, but there's a sex channel on there. I'm like, really? It's really kind of fucked up. So now my problem is I'm driving around with a hard on, and I'm nowhere near a high school. Oh, okay, that's a little fucked up. All right, let me, let, me, let me fix it. Let me fix it. I'm driving around with a heart on it, and I'm nowhere near an elementary school. No, that's not... Okay, all right. I think I, think I have it. I think I have it. I'm driving around with a heart on it, and I'm nowhere near a nursing home. Yeah, that's the one we're looking for. All right, my name is Dan Hall. Thank you very much.